better than this. It's just a dream strike. Brilliant, brilliant effort. Slightly different vantage point in terms of the goal that was scored. nil then I believe there's been a goal in the City game Alan can fill us in it's a goal for Manchester City it's been scored by Thomas Muller receiving the ball in the inside left channel he cut inside and hit an unstoppable shot that left the keeper grasping air four minutes played 1-1 he's got space and he's got the beating of his opponent Plenty of players waiting in the middle. Safe pair of hands, did his job. Well, as we look at the table, it's crystal clear why the away fans are so frustratedly. Well, hands up who thought they'd still be there going into the pointed end of the season. Certainly not me, but who's going to knock them off their perch? They really are a good side, solid players all over the pitch. I think they could go all the way, Derek. And now, this is Longley. And there might well be scope for them to counter-attack here. Jürgen Locadia, Unai Lopez. And you've got to try to make it a bit more difficult for your opponent than that. Alexis McAllister. It's a perfect challenge. Well, the counter-chance looks very real. Can he put it away? Mbappé! And there it is, the goal they wanted for security. They lead by two now. They can breathe that bit more easily. Well, let's just look at this again. Just when you think you've got a team by the scruff of the neck, they break on you like that. What pace, what brilliance. Just look at the movement. It's a brilliant, brilliant goal. Well, no wonder he's delighted. They've been bossing this game up to now. Well, a second goal for them here. Victor Ozimhen. Making excellent progress with the ball at his feet. And crossed in the direction of the back post. And foiled only by the crossbar. Now, what on earth happened there? Cleared away comprehensively. Crisp tackling. And he's going to be disappointed with that pass. In a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Alexis McAllister. And here's Gerard Moreno. Jürgen Locadia. And he's broken free. Oh, it's in! Well, not quite according to the script, but as things stand, they will still take the title. Well, it's just a little warning, Derek, isn't it? They've taken the foot off the pedal the last five minutes or so. Need to press a little higher for me. Surely they can't throw this away now, though. So there we have it. 2-1. A chance for him on the flank. Well, he has clear options in the middle. I'm sure, you know, he wishes he could have that header back. Well, in that position, you should think he's going to score. But it's really a poor effort with his head. A really committed challenge, and it's gone out for a throw-in. Well, Brighton enjoying the bulk of possession here. After that, it's been a little bit disappointing. Creativity in midfield is a little bit off. Certainly too slow in front of goal. Need to get wide, need to get crosses in the box. And possession lost, intercepted. Gerard Moreno, Jürgen Locadia, McAllister. And news of a goal coming through from the Etihad Stadium. Alan McAnally has the details. It's the second goal for Manchester City. 42 minutes, please. 2-1. Alan McAnally with his finger on the pulse. 
A delivery towards the back post. A chance for them to provide a test in the form of a corner. Corner kick played in. He succeeds in clearing it. There will be a minimum of two minutes of added time. An awful lot of green space to run into. McAllister getting forward. Options in the centre. It's got to be! Keeper didn't quite do enough. Half time then. Right now they are in position to be crowned champions, but Lee. Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. McAllister, a highly purposeful attack this. The emphasis on getting the ball forward. Opportunity to deliver the cross. I well, just couldn't keep the ball. It's a weighted pass. Absolutely magnificent goalkeeping. Oh, he's almost turning away. He thinks he scored. The goalkeeper doesn't. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. All in all, a broken counter-attack. And news of a goal in the City game, Alan McAnally. It's a third goal for Manchester City. It's been scored by Thomas Muller. That's his... It has to be! He'll be cross with himself based on the position he had taken up. Well, yeah, it was poor technique, wasn't it? Thrashed at it a little bit, went for power. He's been the standout for his side so far, don't you think, Lee? Well, if he plays like that in the second half, we're in for a real treat. He's scored, he's direct, creative, and he unnerves defenders. Well, quite rightly, all roads lead to Wembley on FA Cup final day, and you'll be able to see the action live with us right here on EA TV. It's Oxford United facing Manchester United. Well, there's few better days on the football calendar than the FA Cup final at Wembley. What a final it promises to be as well. Can't wait for that one, Derek. Shot attempted. Well, it's all going so swimmingly for them here. Another goal. And now it's a matter of avoiding any silly mistakes. Well, let's take a look at this replay. The difference between a good player and some of the best players is they don't need to take a touch. He gets his shot away. First time, nothing else matters but concentrating on that ball. Well, there's nothing better for a manager when a plan comes together. Total satisfaction. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. Well, that's a tale of... Four goals in this match now. Three, one it is. Webster. McAllister. Brahim Diaz now. Paredes. It's with Diaz. Oh, he's given the ball away unnecessarily. Not much time left in this season, but they hold the cards to win the title. Well, it's the top prize, isn't it? All that hard work, this is what it's for. Nearly there now. And a substitution in the offing. There's been a goal in the Manchester City match. Let's hear about it from Alan. It's another goal for Manchester City. 70 minutes played, 4-1. Alan McAnally with his finger on the pulse. The visitors are struggling with possession, really. But on the break, they've been devastating. The pace really hurts defences. They've been electric when they've had the ball. Really a very poor ball. A sloppy pass. A chance to eat into their lead. And this time, it's in!
Well, it's good play. Ian Wright always told me, stand in the middle of the goal. It sounds simple, but you don't have to get a lot of goals from that position. You can't really say defences are on top. 3-2. Neymar is at the back post. Well, far too much on that particular cross. Well, off the bar and out of play. Close. Yeah, close indeed. Technique, just leaning back a little bit. That's why it goes so high. Unai Lopez. Paredes. not looking confident in possession and now having a go well the post getting in the way there well there's a saying in football Derek that you always get one more chance they need that chance right now the fans feel it might be coming too Unas with it Ronael Pierre Gabriel Adam Unas McAllister into the advanced position. Alex Tellez has it. The referee has decided that two additional minutes are in order. Sumptuous pass from Neymar. And he takes it on. Tremendous block. Well, they'll be looking to add to their advantage from this corner. Now the delivery. Well, punch happy, the keeper. And the referee's whistle. That is the end of the story. Memories, memories for players in these situations, Lee. Well, it's always nice to win any trophy, cup competitions, but when you win your own domestic league, that, to me, is the pinnacle of being a player. Yeah, the table does not lie. And so, the league champions... They deserve it. They really have been the best team this season. And that's where you end up, top of the pile. And not by accident either. All part of the master plan. And the trophy is theirs. Well, this is the best moment for me, sharing things with the fans. They've deserved everything they've got this season. The players have, but certainly the supporters. They've given the players absolutely 100% support all season. And this is their reward. Really a match made in heaven between players and fans. And these celebrations are going to continue for quite some time. This is always part of the fun, Lee. The photographs. Absolutely. One for the scrapbook. I'm not so sure players have scrapbooks these days, but I've still got mine in the loft somewhere. So there we have it. The league champions. them ahead and a goal and surely that's one hand on the title oh how important could that be